What's an ATM cost? And what are all these keys on this ring? That's what I'm gonna talk about to you in this video. But before I do, make sure you hit that plus sign and follow me to learn more about the ATM business. And if you got any questions, you can uh, comment below and I'll answer them. All right, so first things first. These mini retail ATMs, but this one is no longer um, manufactured. But these mini retail ATMs that I use are anywhere between $2,200 to $2,500. If you want to, so these are, you know, just the standing ones, you know what I mean? If you want it like a wall mounted one, like one that, you know, you could you know, put on the wall, obviously you know what that means, right? Uh, they, they, they might run a little bit more. I don't have any of those, I, I only have these. Now, as far as these babies, so, um, this key right here is for our mobile kiosks. And if you click the video, once you're done this video, watch this one first, but once you're done watching this video, click the video that I have linked in the description after all the hashtags, you'll see me, what I mean by the blue ATM kiosk. This key opens this. I can't, I can't see it with the camera. It opens that, which gets you to the vault. Now this is an older machine that's got a combination lock. I'll show you what the newer ones look like. This key also lets you go back here hard to do while I'm shooting a video for you guys and open the top part of the ATM. All right. This key, it's a little bit bigger, but it's for this machine, but it's the same deal. You know, you open this bottom part to get to the vault, and this is what the newer machines like, a, a combination, like a number electronic key pad. And it also lets you open the top. Oh my gosh, this is so hard to do with a video camera. Right. This key opens the money boxes. The baby key opens the money ba box in a fixed cassette. A you know, an ATM that has a fixed cassette in it, like this one. This is an old machine and I hate these fixed cassettes. This key uh, was for an old ATM that opened the top of the machine and, you know, the uh, this part of it. But we don't have those ATM anymore, so I don't even know why I have the key. Steven, I know it took me a long time to answer that for you, but there's all the answer to your questions. You guys got any other questions, post them below. Just be happy there's no smell of vision here because I've been playing pickleball for four hours and I stink. I need a shower. All right, guys, don't forget, hit the plus sign, follow me, learn more about the ATM business and passive income. Carrie Buck, may you live happily off of passive income.